everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to be filming this. If you watched my previous Christian Louboutin unboxing, I mentioned the shoes that we are going to review and we're going to talk about on that video. If you haven't watched it, I'll put it right here. First, I want to say for all of you who do not know me, my name is Leslie and I love filming home decor videos, fashion videos, a little bit of everything. But lately, um, I noticed that I really do have a passion for fashion. Well, I shouldn't say lately. I already knew that for a long time. <laughs> but I feel like that excites me the most. If you are interested, I'll have a link down below for the shoes in the description box. So, and as well as a look for less option. So check out down below. That's what I want to do for every video that I make that is for luxury goods. I want to put uh, another option, another more affordable option. The 100 Napa PVC scent. They're from Christian Louboutin. Um, I bought them from Fashion Files, I want to say like a year and a half ago. You guys, I have a few items that you guys have never seen before and I want to bring them out because they're just in the closet collecting this and you guys don't even know I have. Not that you have to know, but you know, maybe I should just bring them out and use them because I, I tend to do that. I buy things and I just let them be in my closet and then a year passes by and then I'm like, okay, I should just wear it now. <laughs> I want to stop doing that. Let me know in the comments down below if you are like me. Do you do that? Because that's, that's something that I need to work on. So anyway, so here we have the box. They were new brand new when i purchased them i did save like 200 bucks from uh the retail price so i will link again the the sandal if it's on fashion files if it's not i will still link it down below and then i'll have a look for less for you guys something that is a little bit more affordable but here we have my sandal you guys i love these sandals and they are so special to me because i wore them for me and my husband's eighth anniversary he didn't buy them for me but I just thought they were so special because we went out on a really nice dinner he took me to Nobu in San Diego I was wearing this beautiful dress it's after I lost like 20 pounds that we went it put some pictures on on what's it called on Instagram I'll insert pictures here too so that you guys can see but I looked so beautiful I felt so beautiful and yeah, so I I wore the sandals and I had fun. Uh, we had a really, really nice fancy dinner, very expensive. <laughs> My husband and I said, I don't think we're doing this again for a long time. Well, that's why we only do things like that um, for special events. But anyways, let's talk about the sandal. I get, I get off track easily. So my sandals here, they are in a size 38 and a half and that is how I discovered the 38 and a half is my size for Christian Louboutins. Um, they're perfect, they're comfortable. This sandal is my favorite sandal, even though I don't wear it because I honestly don't want to ruin it. I don't want to ruin it, but I need to get out of that mindset because I already ruined them. <laughs> I'm going to do a close up for you guys. When I wore them on my anniversary, I was walking like... I wasn't wearing Christian Louboutins. <laughs> I was just walking, just walking, you know, I wasn't really paying attention. But as you can see, the hills got ruined, which is, it is a big deal, but it also is not. Um, because they are expensive, I should be a little upset about it, but it's okay. Like, I'm not mad. I might get them fixed in the future, but not right now. Uh, but yeah, it's it's pretty bad. Oh, I wish I would have paid attention. But anyways, this sandal is so comfortable. The size of the heels, of the heel is 100. So it's about a four and a half inch uh, heel. And right here we have PVC. Super comfortable. At first, they were very tight, so what I did, I grabbed my um, my blow dryer and I start blow drying this. It got really loose and I put it on. It was a little too loose, but then later on it kind of shrunk, not to where they used to be, but where they are now is perfect. And the band right here is super comfortable. It's not tight at all. Um, again, 38 and a half is perfect for me. And then let me show, I'm going to put them on so you guys can see. But over here, this is how you, um, here you go. This is how you 
put the shoe on just like that it is comfortable you guys surprisingly it is really denty very delicate a uh, delicate shoes look this is for my anniversary um, in downtown San Diego so any hoops <laughs> they're really pretty I like them I feel like they are my most comfortable uh, pair that I have red bottoms they are definitely my most comfortable and I would like to maybe in the future not anytime soon I would like to buy a pair of booties because I, I love the way booties look on me. I feel like they make my legs look really, really nice. Because I have toned legs, but I don't... Honestly, I can work out. It's just like naturally. They're naturally toned. You know how some people have naturally nice behinds. <laughs> I have nice legs. <laughs> That's me. But um, yeah, so I like the way booties look. Or this type of sandal. It looks really, really nice. Um... So maybe I should do that. Instead of buying pumps, I think I want to save my money. I would like to get these shoes maybe in the future in black. That would be nice. Uh, and maybe next time I won't use the blow dryer. And I'll just leave them as they are. Because they did get a little loose, which is good. But I feel like maybe the way they were supposed to be um, when I first got them in the box, it was more tighter and secure right now they feel comfortable they feel really comfortable like i'm not complaining but i i want to try to see the difference and that is it for today's video thank you so much for watching you guys i hope you enjoyed hanging out with me talking about shoes um let me know in the comments down below what do you think about the sandal do you think it's pretty uh, i personally love these shoes and i need to wear them more often but then again you guys mom life i like this sandal um because it's simple it's very effortless and sometimes less is more so for example if i wanted to wear a dress that was really you know loud and it had a lot of details or beads or anything sequins this shoe would look really really nice because it will kind of mute it out even though the sole is red it's like a staple sandal but at the same time, it's not going to take away from the dress. As if I was wearing a sandal that was all beaded, then that might be a little too much. Also, what I like about the sandal is that I can also wear it with jeans and just like a plain t-shirt. Um, it's, it's really nice. It can be a casual sandal and also dressy, if that makes sense. Um, I really like them. I like that they're nude, so they match with a lot. I love the signature of the red bottom. I just feel... I feel like um, the red bottom at the back, it's really nice and sexy. And it's what makes Christian Louboutin shoes very special. I, I will, in my opinion, that's what I think it makes them special. Um, and they are like a statement, you know, like a statement shoe. Everyone will look at that when you have your shoe. Because it's like, well, that, that looks different. That's nice. <laughs> I mean, those who know know what type of shoe it is but those who don't i'm sure that they, they probably think it's interesting that the bottom is red which is cool before i ever purchased a pair of christian louboutins i had a black pump that was really pretty i was gonna go on a date night with my husband and i decided to put nail polish on the bottom of my of my shoe <laughs> because i was like i love that look i think it's really cute and sexy so I painted my shoes with nail polish for, it, it took me a couple of days. And then day night came. <laughs> then I wore my shoes and I will never forget that. I wore my red bottom nail polish shoe and I felt like a million bucks. I had like a ponytail up here with um, a cute little skirt and a leather jacket on top. If I find a picture, I'll answer it here. I don't know if I have a picture. I should, I should. And I just felt beautiful i was excited i was oh because that was my dream to own a pair of uh red bottoms um because you guys know i love fashion and if you're a fashionista you like what you like you know for me it's shoes and handbags and dresses Ugh. anyways you guys thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me and talking about shoes and fashion because that is one thing i am very uh, passionate about ever since i can remember and to share that with you guys i i love it it makes me really happy so if you are um, interested again check the description down below 
And it was so nice hanging out with you guys. So I'll see you in my next video. Bye. It makes my legs look really, really nice. I love these shoes. Love them.